A milestone for affordable housing in the city of Newark, decades in the making. Officials and community leaders celebrated the official opening of the new Somerset Brownstones in the Central Ward. A four building development with 60 units of housing, all of them reserved for families earning below 60% of the area's median income. As other cities around the state struggle with uh, trying to build affordable housing, not wanting to build affordable housing, running from affordable housing, in Newark every day we're trying to find a way to build more affordable housing. The $21 million project, which includes a park and playground, was spearheaded by developer the Michaels Organization in a partnership with the Newark Housing Authority. The development went up at a site previously occupied by the infamous Douglas Harrison Apartments, which was riddled with crime and unsafe living conditions during the 80s and 90s. It eventually was demolished. Decades later, the property now a haven for the community. This is what happens when community-minded residents and corporations work together. 15 of the units in the sprawling complex are being reserved for formerly homeless with a preference given to homeless veterans. Each unit is equipped with modern amenities like environmentally friendly appliances, central air and gas heat. We invest in housing because we're investing in people and we know that people make neighborhoods. In addition to the Somerset Brownstones, construction for a massive park nearby is currently underway. It's all part of a revitalization effort here in the Central Ward. In Newark, I'm Andrew Ramos, PIX11 News.